This is Dave Naranjo from LinkedInConnect.com and I wanted to create this quick tutorial for you to show you how to find anyone that you want on LinkedIn using their advanced search function. And um, you know, you don't need to have a premium account to get a lot of functionality out of this uh, out of this tool. And I'll show you how. So, you know, first of all, when you log into LinkedIn, go to this button up here and click down advanced. And then be sure to click on all of these buttons under relationship in order to find the entirety of your market. So uh, let's just do an example here. Let's look for in the accounting industry. In San Francisco, just type in the city that you want or the country that you want. Pull up a pull down menu. Make sure these are checked. They'll check automatically. And then under location, just keep it anywhere. No need to change it to the US because you're already telling LinkedIn that these are the cities that you want to search in. And then what you're going to want to do is just put in a title if you're looking for people by title. Look for people by the current title usually the most effective way. And then just on search. There are 6,173 people in the San Francisco Bay and Greater San Diego areas that are in the accounting industry that have the current title of owner. Now let's say you wanted to find only forensic accountants. So a nice way to do that is to use the keyword section. I would just type in the word forensic. And 134 people pull up that have the keyword forensic somewhere in their profile. Now, this may or may not be the most accurate way to search for forensic accountants or by, for someone that is very specific in an industry. Um, because when you put in the keyword, LinkedIn searches the entire profile for that keyword. So it may not have anything to do with their current experience. This guy might have said, I love forensic accountants, but he has nothing to do with forensic accounting. In any case, it'll help you narrow down the field. And there's several things that you can do to increase the accuracy. So let's say you know that forensic accountants so would normally have the word uh, technical in their profile as well. So what you can do is you can use the word or, and you will find, or actually the best word to use for this situation would be and. LinkedIn will search for everyone who has the words forensic and technical profile seven people that match that. So maybe these would be the best people for me to contact uh, because they very they have very specific keywords in their profile and I know that you know all forensic accountants that are would potentially be good clients for me would have these keywords in their profile. So when you search for keywords don't search for things that um, words that describe what you do. Search for words that the lowest hanging fruit might have in their profile, and this will help you identify people uh, better. So you can use the word forensic, or I'm sorry, you can use the word and, which will find people that have both those words in their profile, or if you can, you, want, you can use the word or, and this will help you find people that have either forensic or technical in their profile. So as you see, this includes more people because these people have both of, have these words, either of these words in their profile. Now another thing that you can do, you can use company to find people that work for companies that have specific words in their title. So let's say I wanted to um, find in the accounting industry in these cities have the word 
uh, is a good word <laughs> in uh, uh, services. Okay. Let me just put services in here. Current, because this would be the current group that they work for. Now, there are 765 people that currently work companies that have the word services somewhere in their company name. This is very useful if you are having a time using, having a hard time finding specific people on keywords. Um, because maybe those keywords are showing up anywhere in their profile and it's not helping you narrow it down. Let's say you wanted to, to find uh, suppliers. So a lot of times suppliers will have a company name with the word supply in there. And this will help you narrow it down narrow down the people using uh, functionality. And that's a, a really nice little way to, uh, a little, little trick for searching for people on LinkedIn. And um, there's other things that you could do as well. You could search for people by their school, college, where they went attended. Of course, you could search by zip code radius as well. But these little will help you narrow down your market and identify the lowest hanging fruit, your best prospects. And these could be your business or if you happen to be a politician and coming into a voting cycle, you can even use this to find uh, people with specific interests that happen to mention it on their LinkedIn profile. So happy hunting and I hope this video is hel helpful. Please let me know if you have any questions. Uh, just contact me at dave at LinkedInConnect.com.